Hey there YouTube, France Hopper here. It's Thursday the 27th of October and tonight we have a uh, special kind of unbagging, unboxing, however you want to classify this. I am going to KomoriCon over the next couple of days and I'm going as a VIP. So one of those uh, perks I get as a VIP apparently is this. And it's more than just a bag, don't worry. This is actually a very heavy bag right now because it's actually full of all kinds of goodies. This is, it, it, it's incredible actually how much weight there is to this bag. So let me take my badge off of it. That's uh, what it looks like uh, for this year in case you're wondering. For the VIP badges anyway. I don't know what the regular ones look like. Um, but yeah, let's uh, go ahead and uh, open this up. So there's a little clip in the front here, which opens up to a plentiful uh, storage. Here's just an idea of how much stuff is in here. There is a ton. This is an, just insane, <laughs> really. Um, so to start off, there's nothing in this pocket. Let's see, nothing in those two pockets. We have some chopsticks uh, in the first pocket. That's uh, what the chopsticks look like. There's a little kind of um, floral pattern on them. Very nice. We'll set those off to the side. Uh, now, inside of the bag, um, there's a couple extra things in here that I threw in there from stuff that I already picked up. So uh, one of the things you get... Uh, with the bag not in it is this guy, Ghost Neko, uh, the mascot of Komori Khan. And apparently I was the first one to get one uh, because they literally just arrived as I was picking up my badge. So that's what uh, it looks like there. Set it off to the side. Uh, also, again, not actually in the bag, but one of the VIP perks. Let me see if I can unfold this here and give you an idea idea of what it looks like. That'll work. This is the uh, VIP shirt for 2016. It's a nice uh, kind of like sky blue color. Let's see, this is a next level apparel. That's what it looks like. There's nothing on the back or the sleeves. Oh, no, I lied. Just kidding. There is something on the sleeve there. There you go, that's on the uh, left sleeve. We have to run this through the wash like real fast tonight. Alright, back to the bag. I guess let's get the program guide out of the way. That's the program guide. If you want to read it, it's online. Um, but it's nice and big. All the uh, panels and maps and such are in there. Let's set that guy off to the side. Let's see, what else do we have in here? We have a clear file, I believe, yes, and I want to assume Attack on Titan. Um, obviously, I, I didn't really watch Attack on Titan. Let's see. Yes, Attack on Titan Junior High, there you go. This is apparently courtesy of Kinokuniya. Very nice. Uh, let's see, we have... Oh my god! <laughs> we have... Uh... Some Komori Khan socks. Oh, that is cool. Very nice. They look like very nice, uh, very comfortable socks. And I'm. I wonder if there's like an entire wardrobe in here. Oh my god. Huh. Let's see. We have a Komori Khan hat with the Komori Khan traditional Japanese seal on it. We have... oh, there's the pocket guide. At least I think this is the pocket guide. I think it's supposed to be a pocket guide. But, um, let's see... Oh, and the scavenger hunt. So, okay, this guy is actually kind of important. Um, yes, this is the quote-unquote pocket guide. Which, I don't know, does it fit into my back pocket? Nope, it wouldn't even fit into my back pocket on my dress pants. Alrighty, what else do we have? We have some Ramune. There's one bottle. And there's 
two bottles. There we go. So we have strawberry and original. Man, is there even like dinner in here? Like emergency rations? <laughs> uh, let's see. We have a Kumori Khan 2016 wall scroll. Let's see if I can kind of open this up real fast and uh, give you a look at it here. And let's see, let's try not to get the staple caught on it. There we go. Alright, wrap it aside. And uh, includes paper or uh, rubber bands. And there we go. That's the uh, wall scroll. Nice little wall scroll there. Oh, that's unfortunate. Oh, jeez, and I think I may have banged up the bottom of mine already. Oh, no, that's supposed to slide so that you can swap out the flag. That would make sense. Alright, let me roll that guy up here really quick. Alright, and let's toss the rubber band back on that. And set it aside. All right. What else do we have? We have the Komorikon VIP glass. I don't think you can really get a good look at it here. Let me get my VIP lanyard out of there. There you go. There's the uh, Komorikon glass. It's a very nice thick glass. And wait, kind of on angle this. There we go. That's what the VIP lanyards look like. They're blue and uh, mighty thick. And let's see. Oh, wow. Uh, this is, I think, there we go. Pretty sure that has Komori Khan. I think that's the kanji for Komori up there. Let's see. And that should be Khan there at the bottom, K-O-N. So that's probably the Komori Khan pen. Uh, flip it over on the back, and there's a little Komori Khan logo on it, which you may or may not be able to see there. And what else? We have a... Let's see. I want to say like a microwavable kind of here probably whoa let's not drop that because this is porcelain uh yep yeah, there we go a little like microwavable bowl sort of thing there we go yeah that seals it in there and everything all right so that's what that looks like and i guess we'll close that up um we also have a little keychain dude there apparently also courtesy of Kino Kunia. And I think I'm getting to the bottom of this. So here's how much uh, space is in there, if you can see that at all. This is a big bag. Uh, let's see. There's a little wallet with the uh, Hokusai Wave. Nice and timely for uh, Miss Hokusai in uh, theaters right now, which was okay. Um, I wasn't particularly thrilled with it. I didn't think it was that great, but it was pretty good. Um, definitely worth a watch. Uh, so let's see. Inside here we have... Not sure if it's a sticker or a temporary tattoo, but there's that guy. On uh, the wall, it's probably like, actually the most important thing of the bag which they stressed very strongly at Badge Pickup because it has my Jump the Line cues. So one daily line jump pass for Sunday excludes autographs. Uh, that's for Friday. Um, that is Saturday. And the other card was the business card of the VAP liaison, which I will not show. All right, so let's put those guys back aside, and let's not forget where I set that. All right, so that's everything inside. Uh, so we'll go ahead and flip that over. But we're not done yet, because there's still stuff on the side. This is nuts. Uh, let's see. 
putting something in there. Uh, let's see this. Probably a battery backup. Yeah, look at that. <laughs> Kamori Khan knows you're going to want your uh, phone battery charged. So there you go. I have a charger for that. Power bank. Let's see. This is a 2600... Uh, I forget if it's milliamps or mega amps, but MEH. There you go. Let's see. Out points 5 volts. All right. And let's see what's in this box here, because something is definitely rattling around in here. In here... Ah, it's the other part of the, uh, what do you call it? Charger. There you go. Duh. I can talk. And, yeah, it's just the USB cable and whatnot for charging the charger. So very cool. And, I'll just toss that guy in the box, maybe? Okay, nope. I can, whoops, I already turned it on. Ah, let's not do that. See if I can actually toss this power bank in the box there. Alright, there we go. Perfect. Uh, and let's see, I think that's it. <laughs> well, I say that's it as if that's it, but I mean, that's a ton of stuff. Holy cow. And this is a pretty good sized bag. I uh, expect to fill it up a little bit over the con. But there you have it. That is. Um, Unbagging, I guess, a 2016 Komori Khan VIP messenger bag and all the goodies that are in it. That'll be it. Possibly see you at the con.